of all stars, it's Ventrix here with another Minecraft video, and today we're back with another RL Craft. It's been a while well since we did RL Craft. I'm sorry for the long pause. I was trying to like do my other series so I could catch up on that, and then I haven't been recording much at all. But I was just, I like to decide to take a dip because I was in my house and I was overheating. I look across, I see this tower over here. Uh, this is all I saw at first, and I look closer, and I see another village. This whole time, not only did we have a village over there, but we got a village over here too. We also got a boat over there, and we got like some floating tree. I saw as the land was jenning in. I was like, wait, is that what I think it is? Because I've seen one of those towers before. It's like, wait, is that village tower? And I look closer, and I wasn't wrong. This whole time, this whole time if we would just went around this beach, we would have been in a village! Oh my god. Thinking about it, I could actually go to this place and just steal some more food for myself, honestly. It's not a bad idea. Plus, all you have to do just to get to it is just walk around this land. I believe um, if we get around there safe. It's a savannah one, too. It's like a savannah house, so... That wasn't you know, <laughs> anything. I, I still remember the embarrassment I had about that one, but... I look across here and I'm just shook to see that I missed something. Oh! Man, I fell in a hole. I'm good at this. Oh, it's turning nighttime and I'm lagging hard. Oh no. This is lag. This is laggy. Um. Wait, where'd the sand go? Of course, it fell down there. Don't tell me you're gonna make me have to put that water in here. I hope not. I don't. Really? My other sand went down too? Okay, fine. I'm just gonna go like that. I was scared that if I dug that out, I was gonna like have um the water come in. And since I heard like a monster in the water, I was like, oh no. Now I'm gonna get killed by this monster because of it. Ooh, an egg. Don't mind if I do. I wouldn't mind, I wouldn't mind expanding my um. My chicken farm, honestly. So we're gonna be getting a few lag spikes here. Maybe it's because my render is super far? I don't know how far my render is, actually. And the last time I played... Oh, look at that, we're on hard mode, too. Um, we're in 16 chunks with 90 FPS. Maybe if I turn up my FPS a little bit, maybe I could get better FPS. There we go. Let's try that. Oh yeah, that seems to run a little bit better. We even got some piggies over here. Dang. We could definitely lure some piggies. Maybe we could actually move into this village, actually. It wouldn't be bad to live in a village house, because village houses pretty much have everything you already need. It has the bed, it has like chests you can put stuff in. Especially if it has one of the houses I'm thinking about. Oh, you see like that big house right there? That definitely has some loot in it. I know about those houses. And look at this! We got, got these guys. These guys are all friendly, so I don't have to worry about anything. We got... We got another... Yes! We got, I got another waystone! So if I, like, die, we can just teleport back here. There's, like, this little place. I want to kind of just explore this village for for now. I, want, I just want to see what everything is. Very quickly. There's just some random acacia door on the floor. <laughs> I'm not gonna question it. Some charcoal. That's never bad to have, especially when you need to smelt things, so you can definitely find some use of that. There's also, like, that. Is there anything in this dropper? No, it's just a random dropper. There's some nice, like, stuff in here, though. Like some random stuff, too. Uh, nothing much in here to look at. Just a random little house with, like, some decor going on. Let's see this one. I've actually lived in one of these, but instead of being made out of this type of wood, I believe it was made out of oak wood. I believe this does have a lot of wheat in it, too. Yes! So much free food right here. This is definitely the way to just get food, honestly. Along with the, like, the other village where like we found all that food, this is like the second way to get as much food as you can. Look at that, even learn how if we ever get like skills. That's if I could learn how to get my skills up. I may have to jump in some water, because as you guys can see, my character's overheating a bit. 
I am getting like spikes here and there too. That's the thing. That's another reason why I'm holding up on the series so much is because I know this, this game lags on me a lot. And yeah. That's another reason I've been holding back on it. I started my other modded because I just feel like this one was just so laggy. If it becomes unbearably laggy, I just feel like I can't play it. Because I was going to fully switch to the other one. I'm just going to go ahead and just sit in this water real quick. Don't mind me. Don't worry. These guys are friendly. Golden Makas and stuff. They're like the... They're the friendly mobs of, um... Like a Knight's mod. So, I'm fine with these guys. I think we should be cooled off enough. Yeah. We should be good. Let's go ahead and keep exploring this big house over here. Maybe we could sleep tonight in one of these houses. I believe if I go all the way up, there's actually a bed in one of the rooms, so. There's a crafting bench. There's even more crafting benches up here. At least I thought there was a bedroom in here. Maybe it's up here? I know I've slept in one of these things before. Maybe I made my own bed and I slept in here? I don't know. But it doesn't look like there's a bed. Oh no, and it's nighttime. Maybe I'll have to stay in this villager house for a bit. Hey, it's not bad. At least we're in um in a shelter at least. It's just that I think my character is gonna overheat. Uh why do you overheat so much character? I need to make buckets that uh, like, if I ever feel like I'm overheating, I could just jump in some like water. It's like right there. Look at this. I think that's a little greenhouse right there, if I'm not wrong. Which is really nice looking. Uh oh. Yep, yeah, I'm overheating. I need to go out into the water. Excuse me, sir. I need some water. Come on me. Let's get you some fresh air, that's all. Oh god, there's a mob added to my beast tree. Oh, okay, it's that thing, and I don't want to go near it. Like I said, you can't, you can't really trust mobs very much in this one if it's a mob you've never seen before just walk away that's all I'm saying it's something you may not want to mess with me I'm outside I'm, I'm doing something crazy that I don't normally do but it's because I don't have a bed I don't have a bed at all this is disappointing I was expecting there to be at least a village in this house in one of these places at least. Like how is there no beds? I thought there only was beds in at least one of the houses in this. I guess it's because the one with the bed at oh wait here, here we go. I can sleep! Yes! I don't have to worry about nighttime. Thank goodness we're we're safe, we're safe. And no more eating either. I believe if I go all the way up here. Look at that! If I have if I could put this on, I'm gonna be so happy. I even got a bow which I need agility for, which I'll I'll take just in case I do get it. Can I put this oh my god, I could put leather on. Yes! Well believe me, leather is better than nothing. And I can't put on a chain yet because I have to put my defense up. If I remember, it's in here. Agility for bow. What agility do I need? Um, agility two? That's all? Let me try. Can I actually shoot it right now? Or, yeah. Acquire level two. Agility? Let's do it. Uh, there we go. Now I can defend myself with two different things. Now if something's far from me, I can just shoot it. Not bad. Another thing I really need to get is by via killing things. Um, I can just kill random mobs and just get some good EXP from it. So I think we should be fine. If I I keep hitting the wrong button. If I go here, if I go to I think I don't think it's gathering. Is it gathering? I th I th you think it'd be mining. Building, gathering, mining. There it is. I want to put some levels into this. So if I put my mining up, if I at least get to four, I think it is, I could pick up iron. I could start mining iron. So, 
yeah, it's something you gotta think about is like, what to kill? Pretty much I could just probably kill some cows and stuff like that for some good fresh EXP. I'm not ready to kill the Makas, because I think Makas are peaceful when you hit them. I just don't want to attempt it. Come back, sir. And, and, come on, cow. Really? And he's gone. Look at that. Where'd he go? Wait. Wait, where'd he go? <laughs> Oh, it's a couple of... What? You guys see that cat? Okay, here he is. There we go. And that's some free XP. Thank god they're all floating. So I couldn't hit them. Or else that would have been a death to me. If I would have hit one of those guys, believe me. Those guys aren't very hostile. Because they protect the village. But if I would have harmed them, oh boy, they would have harmed me. They're like, they're like iron golems in a way. They're friendly and less hit. I don't really think I picked up the food to the other cow, but oh well. I'm good. As long as I'm getting like XP levels. What's this little house? This is pretty random. Is this like a just a random empty house? It is! Dude, I can make this my home. You guys see this place already has light pretty much. And there has like little chests I can place stuff in. I just need to make levers for this. Hey, look at that! A free house for me! How about we move here? I think this would be nice. I'll think about it off camera. I could probably like just drink some water real quick as we're like leaving this village. Uh, I think that was pretty much all the structures that I could look at that were custom. Um, don't mind me. I'm just killing some cows for some EXP. Trying to make sure not to hit anything friendly. Oh god, I'm overheating. Come on, let's go to the water. Let's relax on this nice beach. You can't trust the water in this pack. I'm just thinking about that. That's why I kind of just froze and looked at the water because I was trying to see if there was any monsters that would kill me if I jumped in. That's what I always do before just jumping in. Is I look for monsters first. I I'd be sure that there's no like monsters that want to eat my feet off or else. That would not be good. It would be not a good soak if there is a monster waiting in the water for me to jump in. I think that's like a sunken ship right there too. And that'd be pretty nice to explore if I could. But I'm afraid of monsters, so. I'm not the strongest right now. I'm only in leather, okay? I I'm not ready for this. I know I could farm like those cows and stuff, but probably when exploring the world some more. We could probably find some more. Right now I'm just looking out for some EXP levels so that I could... Jeez. Killing you pigs is making my character overheat for some reason. I don't understand why. Is it really that much work? Is it to kill a pig? I guess so. Never know. You learn things new every day. Let's go ahead and see what I have at home that I could at least take with me back to this place. I believe I have like a lot of wood types, so I'm not going to really have to worry about running out wood. So that's something good, so. Well, my tools break, I can easily just replace it with some more bows from over there. And some more other stuff that I need. If I look down here, is there any like land iron? Or is this like too dangerous to go down? I don't know. Just go look. Take, take a peek. Don't want to take full damage either because it's a risk of me hurting myself and that's something I'd rather not do. Uh oh. Yee! You get that message? You just gotta get out of there. Because what that is, is it's a signaling that there's a monster around and if you're in the dark for too long that monster will attack you. And that is something I'm not ready for. I want to find like open iron, like iron that's just straight in the open, but it seems like there's just none of that around here. I don't see any iron at all actually, all I see is coal. Hmm. Let me go ahead and see if I have any more levels to add to my mining. Could I add any more? No. I need more. I think, I, I think it's saying I need three levels for that. 
Oh, yeah, I think that's what's saying. I can't harvest this yet. <laughs> so yeah, it's gonna be a while till I can get like an enchantment table and that stuff. And of course, getting into like dungeons, so. It was awesome that we found like village near our area, that's not bad. But I just wanna find mobs now that I could kill. So that I could get like some free EXP levels. Nice thinking about it. It's like there's no mob in that um in that stone thing. We could make that into like a farm for like zombies. We could actually turn this thing right here to a farm. But I don't know if I could get that to work. What was that noise? See? And the only door for this thing. I don't know if it goes deeper. It sounds like they're underground. Yeah, it sounds like they're going under. Wait, could they be falling down there? They could be. Yeah. Oh, here he is. If we just use this, and if you walk closer to the block every time, this could be like some free EXP right here. But it seems like they don't want to walk forward. Come on, man. Come here, I know you want this. Oh no, overheating again. Dang it, man. All these intermissions, all I'm trying to do is like, all I'm trying to do is make it so I can get some EXP levels, but I keep overheating. This area is so hot. We live in like a hot area, so I'm not surprised. Think about being a Savannah, just how hot it would be. So my character is right through. So, we got that village now that I could especially return to. We get to move to a house that's a lot bigger than the one I'm living in at the moment. See, if you look at my house, my house, my house still isn't the most spaciest thing. So I think I'll actually go and live in that. I think I just need to make some little, like, little redstone things so that I can uh, make sure to be comfortable there. Except there's light. I know they want to come over here, but... Oh god. Oh god, where'd you come from? Where'd you come from? Oh god. Baby zombies. Worst thing ever. I'm gonna kill your, uh, chicken. Oh god, look at him. Oh my god, look at the way he moves! The way he moves! No, no, I ain't dying to a baby zombie. No, 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 no. You're, no. You're not killing me. I'm not dying. Are you serious? I liked and he would have killed me right there. Whew. Oh my god. My goodness, that was a uh, yeah. Um, let me do H. Um, I'm really damaged in my head area, so I'm gonna heal this. I just gotta hold this down here. I'm gonna heal this. And I'm gonna heal here. There we go. Just help me. And then someday we should be able to, like, at least sometime get loads of wool. That'd be really nice, actually. All I'm hoping for is while I'm living in this little shack, you know, is that we don't get a blood moon. Because can you imagine getting a blood moon and I'm stuck in this? That, that wouldn't be fun. Because I'll be in here looking at my windows and there's no light in this house either, so I don't know. Maybe there's a chance that a mob could spawn here. Because I don't know how to get, like, working torches, so... I need to find, like, other way of light. So, that's gonna be pretty hard. So, that wasn't good. Um, baby zombie just pops out. Yeah. Nice. Okay, this works. Oh, that actually really works. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. I got an idea. You guys know how that's open, and the baby zombie just walked right through there. Let me grab three of these. You gotta recognize what I'm doing. But I'm making it so that the baby zombie can't get out. So I'm making it a little bit tighter, so that while I'm doing this, the baby zombie just doesn't run out like it did last time. Duh. Oh. No? Okay. And as you guys can see, I can now kill this guy. They can't see me. I don't want to break this block because then the baby zombie still have a way to get out. 
Wait, that's all I meant to do. I lagged. Okay. You know what? It doesn't matter. This guy just doesn't want to come over here. Let me just put this here. No. Right. I'm just fixing up a little mob grinder. Like my own special little mob grinder. Here we go. Man, my character's overheating again. Come on, character. Stop overheating in the moment, man. All I'm trying to do is farm some levels and this character overheats so much. Alright, let's add that. I'm gonna get my mining up a lot throughout this episode. Probably my defense. Mining, defense, and weaponry are very important compared to farming and other stuff. We'll get farming later when I feel like I need sugarcane for enchantment levels. But other than that, I think we should be pretty settled for this this thing here that we're doing. So, I just need to keep cooling off. So, that's the only painful thing about living in uh, Savannah. Is I need to run cool off. Maybe I can start adding some water, like, right here. Hello there, sir. Here, I'll, my, I'll swing slower for you, character. Okay, I see how it is. It's lagging. No, oh, my game. Please don't crash. I'll be right back, guys. A little bit of inconvenience here. We're back, and my character, yes, was dying due to something going on. I don't know what happened, but something broke both my feet, so. Great. That's nice. I have to heal both my legs now. After that leg. I blame lag for that. I think lag broke my legs. I don't know how. Don't ask. But I think the leg broke my legs. And plus I was overheating too. So that wasn't good. But yeah. Feels good to have broken legs now. Thanks lag. How could you do this to me? I believe I had to make those um, things as bandages. If I hit R on it, oh, not that. I keep forgetting, like, automatically, yeah, string. Uh, I need some more of that stuff. No, oh no, I have to go with the flint knife and get some string. Wait, you could, cr oh my god, yes. Never mind, I'm actually happy with that, okay. I just gotta take these into halves and, wait. Is that how you do it? Oh wait, no. I think it's like this. Alright, let's make as much as those as possible. Oh, come on, man. You gotta stop overeating. Alright, I'll just heal myself in the water. So I gotta heal my left foot. And my right foot. Because they're both broken. Feels nice to have broken feet from... I don't know what happened during the lag. Whatever happened, my character is getting pummeled by it. I'm not gonna question it too much, but I don't think the game likes that I broke the system. Like, literally. Maybe that's it. Okay, yeah, it's that guy. He has Wither. Ah, oh, man. That's the worst zombie to come out while I'm trying to do this. Alright, let's just look into my skills some more. Um, defense. I want to add a little bit into defense. Like that. That's actually explaining why I took so much damage, probably. Do I have enough for this yet? Or... Yeah, it's level 4. Okay. Let's go ahead. Let's cool off in the water again, because my character likes to overheat. Character, you really got chilled with overheating. I know it's, like, hot here. It's your home spot, so you gotta get used to this. But I think that's where we're gonna wrap up for this video here. Even though I had like a little bit of lag. Like wrap up for this video, I found a way to get some nice EX levels. Just farming that zombie thing as long as there isn't like a super zombie like what's in there right now. Um, from the mod. I don't remember what the mod is called. Inferno mobs. As long as there is an inferno mob in there, we should be fine grinding some levels from that. So we can work on skills more progressively through the episodes. I might start doing that on episodes where I will just go over there, level up a few, maybe um, level up my gear a bit so we can wear the chain gear so we can at least have an upgrade from the gear that I'm wearing right now because level 4, I believe iron level is a lot higher so soon I'll be wearing iron gear 
and we'll be able to protect ourselves from these mobs. But hey, we're doing pretty well. Zero death so far. We we were close to death like a few times, especially that baby zombie. But you know, me and baby zombies plus skeletons don't go well together. So yeah, I got a bow now, so I can shoot things from far away too. So that's pretty good. So, yeah, I think we did pretty well in this episode. We explored another village. We got some leather gear. We got a bow we could shoot with. We got a few of our skills leveled up. And a lot of stuff has been finished this episode, actually. So, that's pretty good. A lot of exploring done, too. So, it's kind of what I want for the series. Sorry about the lag in this series, if there's ever lag in this video. Especially the freeze up right there. Um, it's not in my control. That's why I've been kind of paused on the series because I know I have lots of lag. I'm trying to figure out how to fix that, so I'll try to fix that up a bit more in the next episode. And I'll see you guys in. Like, also, if you guys do enjoy the series still, I know I haven't came up with an episode in a really long time. If you guys do still enjoy the series, be sure to hit that like button, show some support with the series. Also, if you guys are new to my channel and you guys want to see some more Aura Craft from here or all my other Minecraft series or whatever I do on this channel. Be sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you can keep up to all my content. Also, live streams because I love interacting with people during live streams. You guys can go there, be able to talk to me, and all that stuff. You don't want to miss out on that. Be sure to hit that notification bell. Put it all to all and set personal lives, or else you won't get too many of the uh, the notifications of me being live or putting out videos. So yeah, be sure to do that, and I'll see you guys in. The next video or live stream. Maybe we'll maybe we'll keep experiencing on that and maybe we'll explore further in this world. We never know how far we're gonna get in this series before it ends, so I'm actually planning on finishing this mod pack if you guys are wondering. Um if it is gonna be throughout lag, I'm gonna try my best, so be sure to keep an eye out for the series. I'll see you guys in the next one. See you my fall stars. Maybe there will even be some live streams of this thing. You never know. Thank you stars so much for watching this video. If you guys have enjoyed and you guys want to see more content. If you guys are new to the series. Be sure to check out the first episode of this series. If you guys have not. It's really worth it. And also if you guys want another sub content. If you missed the last video I've uploaded. You guys can also check that out. Also don't forget to check out my discord. Join it. You know just be able to talk to the others. Where I do my announcements and stuff like that and also don't forget to check out my planet minecraft account so that you guys can go check out the latest maps i make or latest skins i put up so that's where i'm gonna leave you guys you guys have a great day see everyone